Welcome, Anthony Hudson with you. Welcome to the MCG. Accompanying me is Gary Lyon. Hey, Hutto, really looking forward to the start of this one. Here today, the clash between Richmond and Western Bulldogs. of the coin. Western Bulldog kicking to the left of screen. Both teams outside the top eight, both hoping to gain some confidence here today. Both these teams coming off losses. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. The fans of both sides are waiting this one. And here we go. It's Richmond taking on Western Bulldogs. Pushes off the tackler. McRae lobs the handball. Kicks hurriedly. Doing well with the mark. Crozier gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. 45 metres out. They can't afford to be wasting these shots of goal from the corridor. Going for goal number one. He pops through the goal. Crozier couldn't be happier with that goal. They draw first blood. One down. Has it now. A loose ball scooped up. Now we've got a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Well picked up. Hunter read it best. Hunter throws the ball away. With a driving kick. The mark is taken by Cochin. Looks up with a kick. Martin was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Martin has resources out wide. Out of bounds, right on the 50. Ball back into play. Baker does well. Wallace puts on a foul. The loose ball picked up. Wood throws the ball away. Caddy going for number one. Bolton the better man there. Ten metres out. And the chance at goal is taken by the Tigers. Look at them celebrate that effort. Richmond deliver the first goal. He did really well there and gets the reward. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. Back in the middle. Taps it down. Cochin finds possession. Handballs. There'll be a ball up in the center square. English hits it down. Gains some territory. Asprey just goes bang. Gowers giving away the free kick. The kick from Asprey. Clean pick up by Crozier. 
Wins the race to the ball. Penetrating handball. English steals possession. Richards releases the ball. Did well to get a hand in with quick hands. Fighting hard was Liberatore. Licks with hands. That's touched. And just for the home. Rance to bring it back into play. Decides to play on. He drives it. And the ball trickles over the line. Lloyd heading to the bench. Ball over the boundary line. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Lloyd gets in the way. He's gone. Didn't get away from the tackle. A great defensive effort. Does well to cut off the kick. Drives it long. It's a foot race to get this one. Hunter going for number one. Disappointing kick. Western Bulldog doing well at the moment. Searching for a teammate. Flosto decides to go to himself. <laughs> Weighing up the options now. Plays onto himself. Puts it on the boot. Picked up now. Picks up the loose ball. Bruce was taken high in the tackle. Going for goal number one. A drop cut through the goals. Bruce Love kicking that one. Nine points the difference. Center bounce. English got the tap with a driving kick. Picks it up, brings it out of the pack. Ends up turning this ball over. Flostone slick with the hands. McRae off the deck. Bruce looking to put through another goal. Celebrating hard. Western Bulldog could kick the last two goals. The lead is now 15. English thumps it clear. He's got the football now. Hit the man hard. Flostone with the intercept. Johannesson dishes it off. Slams it onto the boot. Takes it well. A low stabbing kick. The ball spills to Martin. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Wood picks up the loose ball. Uses it by foot. Finds a bit of room to mark. Western Bulldogs are allowing the opposition uncontested marks, but they sit up behind the ball so well, it forces the opposition to play that style. Hunter going for number one. Cut straight through the middle. He celebrates hard after that. That's three in a row for the Bulldogs. Now they lead by 21. Won the hit out. The ball in the hands of Cochin. Graham misses the target. Knew where his teammates were. At full stride, receives the handball. Duray couldn't hang on to the ball. Rioli picks it up. He decides to go for home. Richmond supporters delighted by that effort. That's his first. His teammates rush over. Richmond won't be happy to see that scoreboard. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. He did really well there and gets the reward. We're back in the middle to resume play. Tap came from English. Garthwaite on the ball. Spins out of there with confidence. A great mark taken there. Western Bulldogs have the lead, but they're allowed plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Gower's going for number one. He's able to ride it home from a long way. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Western Bulldog. Lee is now 21. Thump by English. Uses the thump. Garthway scoops it up. Clean picker. Does well to get it out. Prestia looks to work it from the turnover. 
quick hands, and they could be away here. They could just throw it. There's the siren for the end of the quarter. The score is Western the... Bulldogs 33 to Richmond 12. Western Bulldogs could have come out and started well and show them they have what it takes. The coach will be asking for more of the same for the rest of this one. Both sides might want to work on their defence after a high-scoring opening term. English having an impact right now. He's the most dominant player on the ground at the moment. We're ready for second quarter action. We're back in the middle now. Swatson with the ball now. And we'll get a ball up. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. McCray dug out the loose ball. Twenty-two points the difference. Flostone to kick it in. Plays on from the kick in. Goes by foot. A race for the loose ball. Castagna puts it out in front. Ashbury links up with a chance to run. Pumps the ball long. Higgins couldn't snaffle it. Hurry kick. The ball finds Alton. A chance here to convert for Richmond. 25 metres out. An ideal position to be kicking from. Goes for the goals. He blasts it through for another. He's excited about that one. Richmond keeping themselves in it. English with a big fist on it. Is in his possession. Moves it by foot. Marks now and can send it back. Moved on by Grants. Winning the ball in the air was Restia. Uses it across half back. Over the top of the pack. Uses it now. Gets into some space to mark this. He couldn't hang on. Lloyd can link up through hands. Opportunity for Martin. He gives chase to the footy. The ball bubbling around. Smith there to mop up. Charged down by Dunkley. Brilliant chase. He flicks it over. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Takes possession. Broad spills it. Daniel wins the foot race. Oh, what about that? That was really special. That will settle the nerves. Gets his first on the ball. And that puts them further in front. He's enjoying that goal. Big thump from English. He gains possession. Norton will be the recipient of the free. He drives it. Daniel leading the race to the loose ball. Charges with intent. Prestia manufactures a handball. Wood wins the marking contest. Decides to kick. Gathered by Dale, just gets it onto the boot. Stands tall and marks. Interesting handball. Broad goes to the man on the run. Edwards gets on the end of that handball. Edwards gurns a free kick, heads long with that kick. Bolton takes a strong mark. Chips it towards half ball. Baker wins the ball in the air. 45 metres out. He likes his chances from here. That looked great. What a goal. He puts through his first goal. Baker celebrates with the fans. Richmond still within touching distance. Norton gets onto the ball. Garthway keeps it moving. It's cut off by Hunter. Graham just handballs into space. What a goal. Smiles all round. That's two in a row for Richmond. Just two goals in it. 
Umpire ready to resume play. Punches are clear. He wins possession. Narrowly avoids the tackle. Snaffled up by Crozier. The boundary line wins this race. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. This is it off. Norton gives it to the player running pass. He acknowledges the crowd. Western Bulldog with a handy break. They lead Richmond 46 to 30. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Richmond need to find the ball more. If they can get their hands on the ball, then they can start to create some chances. Baker now. Had plenty of the ball. McCray. Hurried kick. Gathers it now. My ball, says the umpire. English just swats it away. And the umpire will ball it up. English clears the contest. Gets a quick kick away. Taking a nice breath. Looks up with the kick. Baker takes it well. Opportunity once again for Richmond to put one through. He slams it towards goal. Nice hands. Ten metres out. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Richmond needs to make the most of their chances inside 50. They aren't getting too many of them at the moment, so they need to capitalise when given the chance. Higgins dropped what he should have taken. A bit too hard with a push, and it's a free kick. McIntosh looks to get onto the football. Finding the loose ball was Baker. The handball hits the target. Graham uses the bump, releases the handball. Finding the ball with ease. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Johannesson takes the mark and contested. Puts it on the boot. Hunter looking to track down the footy. Drop part straight through the middle. Another goal. He's kicked a couple now. Rioli enjoying that goal. Richmond have kicked the last two goals. Richmond behind by four. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Western Bulldogs have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. It's marked by Lloyd. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Going for goal number one. Touched over from behind. Western Bulldogs doing well at the moment. Halftime sees Richmond looking to improve the deficit of five. It's been a promising first half for the Western Bulldogs. They'd be confident they can keep it going in the second half. Can't take possession. What do you make of it all, Gaz? Richmond are struggling to maintain the pace of the game. They might need to slow it down and... Second half action about to commence. We're back in motion. Hammers it. He has the ball. Cochin wants to keep it moving by hand. Ends up with Lynch. Racking up possessions now. Castagna will kick from beyond the 50. This kick will put them in front. He bangs it through. They get around him after that effort. They're in front. About to resume play. 
Punched away. Here's McRae. Ashbury dug it out. English gets the loose ball. Ball gets cut off. Missed the target. Dunkley. Handballs. A time to celebrate. Norton puts his second on the ball. Gets some reward for his efforts. They've hit the front. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. Western Bulldogs have allowed the opposition more of the ball but aren't allowing them to score from those positions. They are defensively very sound. McCray gathers it now. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Goes with the kick. Scoops up the ball. It'll be a ball up on the outer wing. It's very tense at the moment. Thumps it clear. Does well to keep it in play. Eventually, the ball goes over the line. McRae running off for a break. Thrown in now. Swats it. Kept alive under pressure. He looks like he needs a spell with quick hands. Intervening brilliantly was Daniel. It'll be a ball up. Clears the contest. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Can't take the mark. Getting pushed out of the way was Wallace. Rioli looks hurt. Going straight to the rooms. Doesn't look good. That tackle just too high. Caddy goes with the kick. Intercepts the ball well. Good opportunity for Western Bulldogs to put a goal through here. Elects to kick. Good mark and looks to send it back. Prestia elects to kick it long. Scoops it up. McLean couldn't stick the tackle. Dale couldn't hang on to the ball. Gets it away. Going for goal number one. That was sweet. They put through another. Martin celebrating hard. They're in the lead now. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. McIntosh is streaming past and gets the footy. It'll be a free kick for that high tackle. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Going for goal number one. He's really turning it on now. Congratulated by his teammates. Western Bulldogs steal back the lead. Back with another centre bounce. Thump clear. Dunkley did well not to fumble. Fans off the tackler. This is Libertore. Penetrating handball. Graham Campbell's to no one in particular. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. A critical stage of this one. Picked up by McIntosh. Well picked up. Libertore quickly onto the boot. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He needs to find a way into this game. Look at him, he really enjoyed that one. Western Bulldogs could kick back-to-back -back goals. The margin is 11. Prestia uses the body well. Punches the kick. A chance to gather the ball. Gets the loose ball. Duray gets it out of congestion. Coughed up by Crozier. Scoops it up. Collects the loose ball. Daniel just threw it. Puts boot to ball. Terrific mark there. Drives the kick hard. The mark is taken by McRae. Moves the ball by foot. Loses control of the ball. Lobs the handball. Just gave it away. And the mark has been taken. Lining up for goal. 35 metres out. You'd expect this one to sail through the middle. English going for number one. Takes the chance and says thank you very much with that goal. He acknowledges the crowd. The Bulldogs, 71. Lee Richmond, 54. English thumped it clear. He heads for home. 
Bruce does well to mark. 20 metres from home. Wouldn't want to miss these opportunities. An opportunity for a third goal. Look at them celebrate that effort. Now they lead by 23. English with the hit. Dug out the loose ball. Collected by Broad. Baker has a teammate on the move. The tackle over the shoulder. Looks to move it by foot. Good grab there for Bolton. Sinks the slipper into it. Takes the mark. Tries to gain some territory. Couldn't quite with the mark. Rushes with the kick. Scoops up the ball. Uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. Takes that one strongly. He doesn't want to let his teammates down with this shot at goal. Move it on. He drives it towards goal. That one will really lift them. No doubt about it. Lynch loves that goal. Richmond now only trailed by 17. The game is back underway. English won the hit out. Libertore fends off the tackle. Kicks hurriedly. Only seconds remaining in this quarter. Big kick required from this distance. Move it on. He gives it a ride. Richmond trailed by 17. They certainly have a lot to think about before the final turn. Western Bulldogs fans will be hoping they can hold on and get a memorable victory today. Plenty of scoring opportunities in the third term. It'll be interesting to see which team can capitalise in the final quarter. Off hands from McIntosh. Here's Gaz to break down the stats. Richmond are doing a great job of applying pressure and creating turnovers. It's allowing them plenty of opportunities. They just need to convert those into scores. Much appreciated, Gaz. Time to find out what happens in this final turn. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. English hurls it away. The handball now from Cotchen has it now. Just gets it onto the boot. Bruce goes up the deck and nails the goal. Goal number four with that kick. Pretty happy with that one. Western Bulldogs starting to exert some dominance now. They lead 83 to 60. That's a really good team goal. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Western Bulldogs have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. Receives the handball and takes off. Sockers it forward. Applies a bump. Lynch with a short hand pass. Taken by Higgins. Has a man running for him. Baker doesn't take the mark. I haven't seen him for a while, guys. Probably the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Richmond reduced the margin. Suckling to bring it in. Found a way to keep it alive. And the ball ends up over the line. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Johannesson clears the ball from the contest. Doing well to intercept that kick. Hurley kicks it. English determined to reach the ball. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. Norton drives the kick. Takes a strong mark. Got boot to ball. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Chose to kick it. Hurley with an easy mark. Slams it on the boot. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match, Hutto. Edwards was taken high in the tackle. Good grab there from Prestia. He drives it. The contest, no match for him. Of course, Hutto. Kick by Castagna. Slams it onto the boot. Ashbury will be upset with that. Short pushes through with power. Turned it over. Links with hands. Lloyd kicks hurriedly. Oh. 
He might kick a goal. A chance to soccer it and kicks the goal. This kick puts them further into the league. He loved that one. That's two in a row for Western Bulldogs. The margin is 28. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Western Bulldogs can't win as much of the footy but are still controlling the contest. Their efficiency with the ball is superior at the moment. Thrashes it. He gains possession. Edwards just gets it out of the boot. Dunkley didn't mark it. Baker soccer's the kick. Patton goes cleverly off the ground. He kicks the goal. A second goal in the bag. They get around him after that effort. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Western Bulldogs could turn the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Western Bulldogs could win the ball out of the clearance and are capitalising. It's much easier to score when you're always on the front foot. And the mark will be paid. A chance to reload the attack now. Western Bulldogs haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Does well to cut off the kick. They can just slow the game down now and take a bit of time off the clock. Broad flicks it over. Slips the handball to Asprey. Showing control was Rioli. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Great crack. Uses it now. Baker not getting much of it, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Takes a nice mark. Soldo is within range. Goes for the goals. Wow! How good was that? Puts his second on the board. Smiles all round. The Tigers could kick back-to-back -back goals. They have all the momentum at the moment. That's a really good team goal. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Western Bulldogs have gone on top in the marks. They've been able to control the ball in the air and it sees them in this position. The Pretore moves it by hand and now they're away. Use the hands and gives away the free. Liberatore moves it now. Martin Cadet lost it. Using every ounce of energy he has left. He gets his hands on the footy. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Dishes it off. Castagna clinks with a teammate who can run. With the ball now. Kotchin going for number one. Nails the goal. He's excited about that one. The Tigers kept three to row. It's under two goals now. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Richmond need to continue to take their chances in front of goal. It's the only thing keeping them in this. Just manufactures what he could. Quick hands, and they could be away here. A clean picker. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Marks that ball uncontested. A great goal. Bruce makes it five goals. Celebrating hard. 16 points the difference. About to resume hostilities. English got a fist to it. Edwards throws the ball away. Bonson Pally keeping it low. Great mark under pressure. Puts it on the boot. Shaw gives away a free for in the back.
Libertore elects to kick. Johannesson got under it. Western Bulldogs have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Baker uses it by foot. Hooley grabs that one. Keeps it moving. Slams it on the boot. Just put it on the boot. Castagna couldn't keep his hands on it. Joe Hannison got the hands free. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Ends up marking uncontested. Should be relatively straightforward from here. after competing well for a win today. Gary, what do you make of the result? Sometimes you're just happy to walk away with the four points. They weren't at their best, but they did what they had to do. Final scores are 96 to 79. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. It was great being here, Hutto. I can't wait for the next match.